Good evening, this is without question one of the true cathedrals of football. Anfield, the venue tonight. I'm Derek Ray and I'm joined here on the gantry for commentary by Stuart Robson. And the general feeling is we should be in for a spellbinding occasion. It is Liverpool up against Real Betis. Thanks, Derek. Well, often we talk about the tactics, the individual players, players that are missing, but so often it's the mentality of the players that is key to winning any football game. Which of these teams has the right attitude today is the big question. Oh, how about that for the last line of defence? So the starting lineup for Liverpool. Alisson begins in goal. Andrew Robertson starts with Trent Alexander-Arnold in the fullback positions. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. Opportunity it is. In it goes. An early goal. No wonder they're celebrating. Well, first of all, where's the defending? They're all over the place, but give him some credit. That's a good finish. Great composure. Well, back underway, and 1-0 it is. Let's see what happens next. Andres Guardado. Nabil Fekir. He could pick out a teammate. Oh, he looks threatening. Perez. Oh, the referee has given it. Penalty it is. Well, no card handed out. He gets away with a rebuke. Well, a lot of referees would have booked him there, but I'm with him on this one. No yellow card for me. Chance to equalise here. And in it goes, as coolly as you like. Never in any doubt from the spot. So in business once more, on the back of that very important equaliser. 1-1. One, one. Liverpool have given it away. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Uh, plays with a positional sense that is second to none. Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And Salah does the rest. He strikes it so cleanly, he hits it with power and accuracy. There was no stopping that. Well, it's a big moment for him. Just needs to get his players refocused now. Plato for him. Well, here's the replay, and it's a simple finish in the end. But where was the defending? That's just not good enough. Well, Klopp knows this is going to be a tough game now. He's got to get his side back on track here and play him well again. Well, another equaliser. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. Well, the stoppage time situation, one minute here. Gakpo has eyes for goal! Goodness gracious me, how about that for technique? You can't strike them much better than that!
Well, here it is again, and wow, just take a look at this. He's absolutely nailed this one. What a strike that is from distance. Now. Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick. And then Salah's finish is brilliant. He strikes the ball cleanly and gives the keeper no time to react. It's a really good goal. So the current scoreline, 4-2. Bellerin. Bellerin. Could play it in. Cleared away comprehensively. And so into the final five minutes. Getting the better of his opponent. What a genuine opportunity, but it was squandered. Goal kick. And time for the change now. William Carvalho. Well, adding up all the stoppages, we will have two extra minutes. He's in with a chance. Ball is loose. And that is all for this game anyway. It goes into the books as a victory for Liverpool. Well, fairly comfortable in the end, wasn't it? Thought they controlled the middle of the park well. Going forward, there was some really nice incisive play too. It's a good result for them. Another more than effective night's work for Mo Salah. Your thoughts on his performance? Well, he looked a top-class player today. Every time he touched the ball, he was a threat. And he worked so hard for the team as well. What a good display that was.